in order to cross cancel, the numerator of one fraction has to be a factor of the denominator of the other fraction. In this case, in two-fifths times three-tenths, two is a factor of ten. So we cross-cancel with two. We ask ourselves, how many times does two go into itself? It goes in once. How many times does two go into ten? It goes in five times. So now we've essentially created a problem with simplified fractions, and all we have to do now is multiply across. 1 times 3 gives us 3. 5 times 5 gives us 25. For a final answer of 3 25ths. Now we know we don't have to simplify any further because there are no other factors that go into both 3 and 25.